Hey, what's up everybody? It's Gerald. I wanted to come to you and talk to you about one of the songs that we sang this past Sunday at church and that we're going to also sing again this coming Sunday at the Mallory Creek campus of Hickory Grove Baptist Church. Um, the song is called Is He Worthy? It's a song written by a guy named Andrew Peterson who's a great musician, um, artist, uh, worship leader. He's uh, He's been around for some time. Uh, the lyrics are beautiful. Um, it's a call and response type song. Um, really really strong song and Shane and Shane actually came out with a, a really good band version of the song and so we took that version and uh, and uh, played it for our people led our people in it this uh, this past Sunday um, I wanted to read to you just a, a portion of the lyrics which comes straight from Revelation chapter 5 and I read this on Sunday as well but just wanted to give it to you as well Revelation chapter 5 verse 9 says and they sang a song a new song saying worthy are you to take the scroll and to open its seals. For you were slain, and by your blood you ransomed people for God from every tribe and language and people and nation. And you have made them a kingdom and priests to our God, and they shall reign on the earth. This call and response song is so incredible because I offer up a line, and the choir and the congregation sings back, we do. The very first part of the song, do you feel the world is broken? We do. Do you feel the shadows deepen? We do. But then um, then we have this, this hope in Christ as the light that comes into the world and pushes, pushes the darkness back, pushes the darkness away. That's the hope that we have. And kind of the, the remedy, the solution for all these things that happen in our world today is Christ. He's our hope. He's everything that we need. So as we sing this song again on Sunday, I want you to be reminded of the hope that we have in Christ and the light of the world that he is. And so hope you have a great week, and I look forward to seeing you on Sunday. Thanks.